Hi guys, this is Yamini and welcome to my start of Germany. This video is the second in the FAQ series about freelancing in Germany. I will talk about different types of German tax IDs for self-employed people and how you can get them. And I will also explain how to register as a freelancer in Germany. So let's start with the basics. What is a German tax ID aka Steuer Identifikationsnummer or Steuer ID for short? A German tax ID is an 11 digit identification number. It's kind of like a social security number in Germany and it remains same throughout your life. So even if you move to a different state in Germany at some point, you will still keep this number. How to get your German tax ID? You will get your German tax ID automatically after registering your address at your local town hall. It can take up to three or four weeks from the day of the registration to receive this number. If you ever lose this number, you can just request it online again. I have put the link to this online form in the description below. What is a German freelance tax ID, aka Steuernummer? All self-employed people in Germany pay taxes through a specific tax number, which is called Steuernummer. Now keep in mind this is different to the Steuer ID that I just described a few minutes ago. You get your freelance tax ID by registering your business with the local Finanzamt. And if you ever move to a new city in Germany, you will have to restart this whole registration process, which means you will have to get a new German freelance tax ID as well. What is a VAT ID? If you have VAT obligations in Germany and you have to charge VAT to your clients, then you will have to get this special ID called VAT ID or Umsatz Steuer Identifikationsnummer in German. A European VAT ID is a nine digit number and it always starts with country code. How to get your German VAT ID? You can get your VAT ID when you fill up your German freelancer tax registration form. Not everyone needs a VAT ID though. If your annual income is lower than 22,000 euros in first financial year, then you can register as a client Unternehmer, which is basically small business regulation in Germany. Under this regulation, you will not have to charge or pay VAT to your clients. And you will declare VAT to finance arm just once a year. So how do you register yourself as a freelancer in Germany? You start this registration by filling up a form called Fragebogen zur Steuerlichen Erfassung, which is basically a tax registration form. Now there are three ways to submit this form to your Finanzamt. Number one, you can get a Steuerberater to fill up this form on your behalf. Two, you can submit the form through Elster. Now Elster is the official online tax filing tool by Finanzamt in Germany. You can fill up your freelance tax registration form on Elster itself and send it to your Finanzamt. And the third way to register yourself as a freelancer is by using an online tool, which is also one of the easiest ways to do it since you can do it completely in English and also without registering for an Elster account. And through these online tools, you can also easily apply for your VAT ID at the same time. I have a separate video where I have explained the entire process. So go ahead and click on the link on the screen right now to learn how you can register as a freelancer in Germany very easily without Elster and completely in English. So I hope that this video was helpful and you have a better clarity about German tax system now. If you would like to watch more content like this, then please let me know in the comments below. Thanks for watching.